is bad. Hit it. Ha. Sam Hit it. and ha. Oh God. Ha. What's Hit up it. with you? Hip hop uncensored is the vibe, so subscribe. Hip hop uncensored is the vibe, so subscribe. Oh God, driving Sam and riding passenger side, and you heard it out the mouth of the greatest rapper alive. Interested in promoting your brand, business, or talent on Hip Hop News Uncensored? Hit me up right now at advertise at hiphopun.com. That's advertise at hiphopun.com. Hit me ASAP. Very affordable rates. Now to our regularly scheduled program list. All right, man, we got some unfortunate news to pass along for A.R. Ab. If you haven't been following his federal racketeering trial, A.R. Ab and his other uh, co-defendants were pretty much convicted last year of running a drug operation ring in the city of Philadelphia. Now, we were waiting for him to get sentenced, then COVID hit, so it kind of pushed everything back. Well, the judge stopped short of throwing the book at A.R. Ab today. Sentencing A.R. Ab to 45 years in the federal penitentiary for his alleged role in that drug operation. Now, um, before I get to a couple other things, man, I got to say that we sat in the trial and it looked like the fix was in it. I didn't really see him get a fair opportunity, honestly, you know, really honestly. But again, there's always a chance for an appeal. Now, A.R. Ab allegedly in court said this. He said, the court, the FBI agents, the prosecutors don't understand my culture. We don't rap about flowers and rainbows. We're gangster rappers. We rap about what we grew up in. So we rap about drug dealing and we rap about violence. Pretty much meaning to say like none of this stuff was real. We're just rapping about it. I didn't really do it. Or well, the prosecution, the jury wasn't buying it in this case. And they slapped him with a 45-year sentence in prison. Now, ARF fans out there, this is not the end all. Be all because I did hear ARAB talking in a few interviews, and he said that a real high percentage of people in the feds come back on the pill. And for what I see with my own eyes and what I hear, he has very, very strong reason to believe that he can win on a pill. Now, what does this mean? It may be a sentence reduction. He's now, I know, pushing for a new trial again. So we shall see how this goes. This is not the end. This is just a temporary defeat right now. And if you heard Al Rap talking on his interviews, you can kind of hear the pain in his voice right now. Not a real good time. Now, we can remember it was also a time where he was suffering behind bars, not getting the proper type of uh, medical attention. He seems to be in good health right now. We had his brother, Leek Moss, on here. He's always giving positive updates about his brother. But sad news, man. A.R. Rapp sentenced to 45 years in prison. What do you guys think about this sentence? Do you think that it was harsh? Do you think it was too much? Do you follow his music? Do you think that he would come back on appeal? Now, I know the other co-defendants copped out and got a little bit lighter sentences than his. And I also know that they originally offered him 22 years. But I heard his interview... And he was pretty much saying, like, they want to throw the book at him. They want to give him life. And this is pretty much um, tantamount to a life sentence for a guy who's almost 40 years old. So, tough, tough situation. Let me, no, 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 let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Go ahead and smash the like button and make sure you share this video. And I'm going to be looking at you guys' comments all day, man. This is your brother, Oh God, man. Over and out. Peace.